seven foot three seven foot five in shoes 230 pounds an eight foot wingspan with a ridiculous shoe size of nearly 21 and don't expect him to stop growing these insane measurements are just a little bit about victor Wembenyama. He's stuck to a crazy diet and workout since he was just 15 years old to develop and prepare his body for NBA basketball. And Wembenyama has bulked up, as shown by these social media pictures. But since working with a team of over 25 different trainers and specialists, it's the small details Wemby has paid attention to that have made him into the player he is today. And he still does occasionally take himself out for a fancy cheat meal or even a leisurely day of art. Now first, workout. How does Wembenyama's workout compared to the normal NBA player? Well, the average NBA player works out daily. Wembenyama follows that blueprint exactly, also working out extensively every single day. And he still has time for his extremely important recovery routine, which we'll get to in a moment. But he does everything, from his own special toe exercises to a routine you would not expect. It's what Wembenyama is not doing that's drawing attention. This, according to Draft Express. He still has not lifted a weight in his life because he, he wants to fill out his frame naturally. He doesn't want to get too big. He doesn't want to lose that mobility, that fluidity. It has also been said, according to ABC News, that he does two hours of additional exercises every single evening, not for the purpose of weight gain, but rather to build up his strength and durability. So what about these unusual exercises we've seen from Wamanyama? Flexibility exercises. Wembenyama goes through an insane series of flexibility exercises not only before games, but also during and after he's played on the court. This includes multiple sets and reps of this exercise that's very much like a bear crawl, while also doing a version with just his fingertips and toes. Add core exercises, push-ups, and much more. And again, no extensive weightlifting. This allowing him to grow naturally into his body. He's even done tons of additional work with his feet, back, and knees for added stability. But will a bolt come down the road, much like other players he's been compared to? And before we discuss that, let's talk about Wembenyama's special exercise we brought up earlier, toe exercises. One of the biggest topics of discussion has been Wembenyama's big toes. Because of his ridiculous size and frame, he has been doing what they have been calling special toe exercises, band work, stretching them to create strength and resistance. But how did he get his crazy coordination? Coordination exercises. Wembenyama has amazing coordination, especially considering he's still growing into his body. This is because of the many hand-eye coordination exercises he does on a daily basis. And these exercises have drawn crowds. This includes juggling with tennis balls as a quick pregame warm-up. He can even juggle three regulation-sized basketballs at one time, something he did during this slam photo shoot. And now, to the exercises that developed his unique on-court style. Basketball exercises. Wembenyama has said himself that he has watched a ton of Kevin Durant in that scene in how he plays and shown in his personalized workouts. In October 2022, he went to Nevada and did these guard workouts. He also has his very own pregame shooting routine seen here. And it was said that Wembenyama learned a lot of his guard and dribbling skills from practice videos by Pete Maravich. But it will shock you to know how early Wembenyama has been doing basketball workouts with the best players in the world, like here. Seen squaring off against Rudy Gobert when he was just 16 years old and only 7 foot 2 at the time. It does make sense though because he's been playing professionally since he was just 15 years old. But there's one specific exercise that's more important than everything we have just discussed. Wembenyama's most important exercise. This part of Wembenyama's training will be the most important for his career moving forward. Since he was 15 years old, Wembenyama has been working with one of his many trainers on this one very specific thing, landing, specifically extremely softly, because a body of his size has very little room for error when landing back on the ground. One bad angle could end his career just like that, and it's in part in how he plays. With the evolution of basketball and positionless basketball, Wemby has worked with full-time specialists who have dedicated themselves entirely to helping him take care of and develop his body for the game, opposed to the game of the past. But now is a part of Wemby's routine that is even more important than any of these exercises. Recovery. 
Wembenyama has additional trainers who help regulate his sleep in a pretty funny way. His specialists and trainers say 8-9 to nine hours of sleep is good enough for a good night's rest, but they would prefer at least 10 or even 11 hours each night for maximum recovery. How do they regulate his sleep? Wembenyama has a trainer based in Paris who sends him nap time reminders, even clearing Victor's afternoon for a recovery nap. Another trainer waits for text messages from Wembenyama every single morning just to see how he slept the night before, tracking all all of this information manual. And with all that rest, you also need food to refuel. What does a giant like Wembenyama eat? Diet. Since his mid-teenage years, Wembenyama has been eating an absolutely ridiculous number of meals every single day. With his massive frame, Wembenyama has had to eat an insane amount of food to progress his body in the direction of an NBA player. But before we get into how many meals Wemby has, let's look at the normal NBA player. The average NBA player has anywhere from 2,000 to over 4,500 calories every single day, which, according to USA Today, is already nearly over twice as much as the average male. But now, Wembenyama. It is interesting because according to Wembenyama's agent, weight is a touchy subject, so he doesn't want to put on too much weight too quickly. That could rapidly end his career. But since the middle of the COVID-19 pandemic in 2020, Wemby has been working with another train. This one, Tim Martin, is based in Dallas, Texas. Martin employs a personal chef who makes all the meals for his clients. This includes Wembenyama. And since Wemby's mid-teens and through the pandemic, Wembenyama has been eating five meals every single day. This is to have his muscles grow naturally with his bones as he continues to grow. This diet remains clean because according to his agent, he likes good food. But even a player like Wembenyama needs a cheat meal. He'll obviously dabble in the French cuisine as this is where he's from. And while working out in Texas, Martin treated Wembenyama to the local Texas cuisine barbecue and a quick stop at Texas Roadhouse. And Martin said they went there for one specific reason. He had to try the rolls. He loved the rolls. This is just one part of the leisure that comes with Wembenyama's routine. He even finds time in his busy days to draw and sketch for anywhere from a couple minutes to a couple hours. But ultimately, according to ABC News and his team of over 25 different trainers and specialists, this is what Wembenyama's daily routine looks like. That's the life of a free athlete. This comes from his insane work ethic and a little bit of his genetics. His mother played pro ball in France and his father did track and field. The genetics are there, but how will he develop? But even Giannis, who some have compared Wembenyama to, was also much lighter when he entered the league in 2013. Giannis stood at 6 foot 9 and was just 190 pounds. He now stands at 6 foot 11 and weighs 242 pounds, an insane addition of 50 pounds of muscle. But Victor Wembenyama has prepared himself for the next level since he turned pro at age 15. What do you think is in store for Victor Wembenyama? And what do you think of his diet and unique workout routine? Let us know in the comments and subscribe for more.